And how about sound? Do we have sound? Don's testing. I'm testing. We don't want it echoey, and we want it loud enough. We have sound. Okay, awesome. Hello, hello. Just got my YouTube reminder. Yeah, we just wanted to start um, a little early, just to give everyone a chance to get over here. Judy Quilt, Sarah, Karina, hello guys, and Julie, hello. So looking forward to the All Access. Haven't looked through mine yet. I like to look at it with you all. Yeah, I haven't looked either. However, I've been staring at the cover <laughs> for however long. Since yesterday. Since yesterday, yeah. That was bad. We had such a bad storm yesterday. It was awful. We were out power out for what? Five hours. Seven no, it was longer than that. Was six it? six, seven hours. Yeah. Um, apparently there was a lot of trees down that took down the pi power lines and the poles. So it was quite something to fix. So we're happy now, but I was like, Oh, I need a good design. Oh Boot to the storm, but glad you're safe. Thank you. Yes. Um, we don't usually have bad things that like wreck houses, so this is about as bad as it gets, I think. Cindy King, working and listening. Hello, Ann Dilbeck. Hello. Uh, Brenda says, we've had so much rain, I need a boat. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sue says, Florida here. I can't always get to watch you, but so glad when I can. Yay. Robot Sue voice. Uh, what's That's fine? Let me check again. Don's gonna check. <clears throat> I'm watching while the Norseman is changing the battery on my mic. <laughs> oh, on her motorcycle. Sorry, going for a ride today. Awesome, awesome. Rides are great. You done hot echoey. Probably the internet. Yeah, sounds fine. It should zing back in. That's YouTube oh, doing that. Slightly tinny. Turn it down a little bit. Yeah, sounds weird. There's nothing else hooked up, so... I know, it just might be too loud. Or I might be too loud. Is that bad, sir? No, it's... Echo. Can you hear me when I do? No, wait. Can you hear me when I do this? Just a small echo. It's okay. Better now. Can you hear me Go now? Go back to the other way you did the first time. How about like that? Can you hear me? Not that much, jeez. Yeah, like that. Total job. Good morning, all. Good morning. So it's good now. Better now. Yep. All right. Good to go. Good to go. All right. What time is it? Yeah, we're ready to start. So, welcome everybody. Um. Hey everybody and welcome back. My name is Sue and I'm from OML Embroidery and my sidekick for today is Dawn and Hello. we are uh, going to do the flip through of the June 2022 Midsummer Night Tapestry. No, it's the All Access. I really want to <laughs> see the Midsummer Night Tapestry. I love it. That's all. Um, all access, I need a good design, and I think this is going to be awesome. Did I say that I wanted to see the Midsummer Night Tapestry? You did. I'm thinking glow-in-the-dark thread already. I got yeah. ideas. I mean, yeah, you know. So, let's get started. Quick, quick peeks. Look at that train. Ooh, awesome playmat. Okay, these guys are cute. Moody plant pals. Oh, so they're happy or surprised. 
that's super cute. Super cute. Release radar. So this just gives us an overview. It is cute. That is really cute. Wow. The details. Uh, ooh, there we go. Tapestry. Oh, wow. Oh, these guys are so cute. Moody plant pals. Ooh. Seasonal house trios. That's neat. Ooh. I like that, actually. That's really cute. Bold blossoms. Oh, my. Oh, charming cottages. Oh, these are the oh, ones that like look that. like paintings. Yeah. I can't wait to see. Okay, so we're going to start off with seasonal house trios. And wow, these are cute. Oh, Christmas, of They're, course. Yeah. I like Santa and his reindeer. That's I neat. like that. Sweet scenes for each season. Look at the detail on this. I really do like the sunflowers, tall sunflowers. Mm -hmm. It's awesome. Plant pals have me sold, <laughs> says Brenda. I know, they're super cute. I can't wait to see them. Um, these are gorgeous. Cool colors for winter. Look at the detail. Oh, that's so perfect for that room. The Spring's colors. Nice. Yeah, so is winter, mm -hmm. actually. Neat. Okay, well, Christmas. Wow, those are cute. Oh, I like it. So, I like the pillow. Yeah, isn't yeah. that cute? Mm -hmm. I like the shape and then the things around it. Uh, that looks really cute. Stitch out each season. So I like winter. Uh... I like spring, puddle jumping, puddle summer, jumping. and fall. It looks gorgeous with the gold behind it. Mm -hmm. Great as hangers, yeah. So there's going to be applique, seasonal house design. Oh, this is the sky. And Oops, wrong way. Sorry, my bad. Applique. So the houses and the sky and obviously the background is applique and the rest is stitching. That is gorgeous. I like the little gloves and the hat. Up Around the, the side, yeah. yeah. It's very nice detail. Yeah, lots of detail. I just like the shape of it and the mm -hmm. whole the whole bit. I love it. Now we can see them nice and big and close up. Uh, it's kind of neat with the purple. I didn't notice that before. <laughs> Matches the outside. I just had a powder outage, my own doing, back up again. It's not from us. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't do it. We're we not, didn't we're do not it. sharing what we had. No. Um, and I love a snowman that's so cute, playing with the puppy. Spring. Yeah. Wow. Like a little rabbit in the wheelbarrow. That's cute. And the puddle jumping. Oh, with the umbrellas down the side. And the little snail. <laughs> Um, Judy Quilt says, I love these designs. Yeah, I really think they're cute. They're adorable. Oh, yeah. Planting in spring, of course. Summer. Barbecue. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. Barbecue. So many details. Yep. Swing set. Picnic. Autumn. Oh, man. Oh, Scarecrow's cute. He is in a pumpkin. And the fall. The houses are super cute, too. They are. Awesome. Oh, I'm glad they threw in Christmas. The little guy raking leaves. <laughs> it's awesome. The detail is incredible, and the colors they've used, too. So, Santa and the snowman waving hello. I love the Christmas house. Mm -hmm. And that one. Little elf and a little tree. Oh, penguins! Oh, we love penguins. Penguins. Ah, look at the detail on the house. I love it. With the snow on the roof. Yep. And different ornaments in the corners. Um, I like that. I think we need to do one uh, yeah. for a stitch along because I think that's really cute. You could also make them into quilt squares. Um, mm -hmm. Like a hanging. I think that would be adorable. Hmm. Okay, this looks awesome. Charming cottages. They look painted. They look painted. Yeah. I, I'm, I was taken aback by the orange at the top there. 
Look at those stitches, all the detail and the trees. Yeah, definitely frameable art. Judy Quilt says, yes, we need to do one. Yeah, I think so. It's gorgeous. Oh, beautiful. A little cat laying on the shelf. On the, on shelf, the shelf, yes. Look at this, with the pumpkins. Perspective. I like that. I really like those scenes. Yeah, beautiful. That would be something that I would um, like sit and watch stitch out. Definitely. Because I think that would be really cool. This is beautiful. Oh, and a door, a Christmas door. Well, beautiful. Christmas cottage. I, I love this with the snowman. Oh, and then the beautiful flowers. So many details. That is so cool. Oh, yeah, there you go. That one's just beautiful again nice. with the perspective. I love it. Mm -hmm. These are all stitching, too, right? There's no applique to them? Uh, I think they're all stitching. It might be applique under the main colors. I'm Maybe. not really sure. Um, this would be good for a time-lapse video, too. Mm -hmm. I'm always thinking about Sharon. What would you put these on? Um, you could make them into quilt blocks, a pillow, or uh, frame them. They're beautiful for framed. And they showed it on an apron. You could do it on a t-shirt, too, if you wanted. And a sweatshirt. And a sweatshirt, yeah. I think that would be stunning on yeah. a sweatshirt. Oh, yeah. Oh, look. Chickens. Ah, chickens. I love it. <laughs> I love it. Oh, that's beautiful, too. Uh, with the black cat. I love it. I love it. Um, we'll have to check at the end and see about stitches and applique, but I think these are a very light stitch. So really, the answer is anything. What about a placemat with oh, some yeah. quilt blocks around it? So country style, um, you know, placemats. I think that would be perfect. I can't get over how beautiful these are. Isn't that awesome? So, yeah, lots of ideas with that. Joan says, absolutely beautiful. Um, yes. So, uh, coming soon, which is one of my favorite things. Uh, look at these letters. Absolutely adorable, freestanding designs. Mmm, I like it. I like it a lot. Dragonfly Garden. Well, we all love dragonflies, don't we? I like those birds. We're not there yet. Oh. I'm talking wife. over here. <laughs> I jumped ahead, sorry. Whoa, big fella. Whoa. <laughs> back, back. So, now... I like those birds. <laughs> there you go. Regal black, word, black work birds. I love black work. It is I love the beautiful. detail in them. In the black work. Yeah, it looks like a <clears throat> pen sketch. That's some of my favorite stuff to actually digitize is black work stuff. Well, and it's, um, there's a whole bunch of other nice birds on. <laughs> <laughs> I know. That shows you how much he listens, right? Are you listening? I'm no. Listening. No, you're not. So it's a nice light stitch, but it has a lot of detail. Incredible details within. Oh, wow. You know, you could color these in, too. Yeah. And, you know, put the flowers with shading on it. Oh, these are beautiful. I love them. They're all wow. beautiful. Beautiful flowers and beautiful birds. Black work would be nice on the back of a blouse. Absolutely. Wouldn't that be gorgeous? Mm -hmm. Anything. Anything goes. But it's a nice, quick, easy stitch. So again, you could frame them. There's a lot of things. You could mix and match them for sure. Um, it's cool. Morning, Joy. Thanks for joining us. Oh, so be Oh, look at this guy. Ah, I think coloring. That's what I keep seeing. <laughs> they do look like coloring book pages. 
They kind of do. They kind of do with some fabric markers. Beautiful. Be well, they are stunning. Beautiful. Oh, look at this one. Nice. Okay, well, that's it. That I, I think that would be fun to stitch out, too. Mm -hmm. I need some fabric pens, and says Sarah. Yeah, I think it would be a lot of fun. I think it would be. So, sneak peeks. So geometric. That is one heck of a fox. I got to tell you, I love <laughs> it. I love it. I think that's awesome. Yeah, the horse is pretty cool. Yeah. Black, white, and autumn. Well, look at that one with the cat and mm -hmm. the black and white. Love it. Nice style. Art Deco quilt. Animal tribe. Oh, this is the Art Deco quilt. Oh. Ooh. I like. Ooh. Not so tricky textures. I love the sneak peeks. They always make me happy. Love the pumpkins. Yeah, me too. Polka dot pumpkin, because why not? So, organza, burlap, glitter vinyl, velvet. So, a little chat about uh, each, you know, texture. Oh, you called it. What? It's on the midsummer night somewhere. Yeah. It looked like velvet. Yeah. So, textured collection. So, these are uh, other collections from Anita Good Design that use that you can use different kinds of fabric. So it's a nice explanation of um, you know the fabric. So diamond dust, ooh, a tile scene for the solstice solstice, midsummer solstice. Oh, that purple oh, yeah. and what color is it with the purple? It's like a tan? Why does that look so good? It almost looks like almost it could be a, a pale pinky. Pink. Yeah. I'll have to look that up. Uh, that's stunning. That is really even black and white too, and that's just part of it framed. Nice. Wow. Oh, I love that. Wow, that is something. Oh, look, there's different outsides to it. Oh, yeah. yeah, I didn't realize that. Um, sashing. One's wider and one's narrower. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Yep. So how big? Oh, can you imagine doing each one 10 and a half <laughs> by 16? Can you imagine that? I mean. You know how awesome that would look, though. Well, it's only one color, so I wouldn't have to change threads all the time. So just bobbins. Just <laughs> lots and lots of bobbins. That would be fun, though. Uh, nine and a half by 14, 8 by 12, 7 by 11, 6 by 10, and 5 by 7, which is awesome. That is awesome. Nice small one, yeah. Yeah. Fabric, threads, <laughs> velvet, metallic... <gasps> Metallic thread? Ooh. Ooh, nice. that would be nice. Well, they're going to use velvet, so... Um, well, I think it's a good choice. I think it's beautiful, yeah, for sure. I've never actually done embroidery on velvet. Not at all. So, batting, put your batting down, and then put your velvet down, stitch it down, and for velvet, you use a little bit of water soluble stabilizer so that it holds, help holds um, the thread up. And then you just peel it off, trim it, and it's beautiful. So even black and white is gorgeous. Oh, yeah. Oh, we get to see all the blocks now. Okay. The detail. Sign me up. Yeah, I really like this. And then when you're sewing together, I've done a couple of videos on how to match these up perfectly. So, yeah. Oh, and a bee. And another bee. Awesome. I'm going to have to find some really, really nice background fabric for this. A lot of beautiful details. Oh, look at these. Gorgeous. And it wouldn't take too long to stitch out, and I think it's going to look fantastic. 
the stitch angles that they use make it they add to the details quite a bit simple and easy yeah this mushroom someone said that sarah said that sorry yeah that is like you could frame just that piece or part of it like you could put two of them together love it a snail mushrooms bees everywhere Snail, dragonflies butterflies Ooh, okay that's awesome now we're gonna go to the sashing so uh, this is the thin that we saw and this is the thick and I'd have to think about which one I like the best yeah they're both amazing yeah the detail in the smaller one but look at this cornerstone um oh, i like this little dragonfly one too it's cute yeah right there. yeah mm, that would be a tough call don't know have to do one of each well you one, could one with a thinner one and one with a bigger one but you could do one design and put the thin one and then the thick one yeah you could oh see there we go make oh. a lumbar pillow so just using a, a couple, couple of blocks that's awesome that is yeah and then they're gonna tell us how to do it sarah says i would love to see it stitched on your big 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 hoop <laughs> i know i'm honestly i'm thinking about it i'm not sure if i have the resources um we'll check out the stitches at the end and yes i love the cushion with the tassels beautiful so stitch it out i love when they do this this helps so much with the sewing tape the tassels down well that's pretty simple to do that's really simple to do stuff it so sew them all together each side put your tassels in before you finish and um turn it hmm. stuff it close it beautiful yeah. <clears throat> i wonder if it's the colors kind i like elegant looking you know lynn could do hot pink with a white background we could make some tassels yes my back feels great just seeing it nice <laughs> nice so this is um i wish i had this when my kids were little the train track and then yeah, there's a that. town sort of thing yeah i think these are just awesome and awesome for kids to play with look at this yeah see you just roll it up my kids would have loved this so there's a race track there's what is it recreation that? station recreation station um and grease monkey garage so this is like a box and it opens up kind of oh, like a neat. barbie house yeah, they've got yeah. a couple of them and it's all the outside and the inside is all decorated and uh it's That's, pretty cool that is pretty cool yeah now this i love i love choo choo i love the top view and of the, the, the bushes <laughs> yeah it's cool actually <clears throat> let's talk textiles yep i remember these wooden toys yeah i remember those so nine and a half by 14 is the biggest size eight by 12 seven by 11 six by 10 and five by seven that's amazing that they get it down um so low like so small mm -hmm oh look the perspective again is amazing look at the cows yeah, there, yeah. it looks like you're looking over and the way they've done the barn yeah i love it uh sarah says my son would have gone demented for the train track wish i could turn back time yeah, yeah my kids both my girls would have loved it absolutely so love the green so we're gonna start off as usual trim the batting put the background and then appliques 
So look, it's got a little wobble in it for the train tracks. Oh, yeah. oh look, perspective again. Little service station for the train. That's awesome. A little <clears throat> bit of shading and lettering. Yep, I love this. And then, too, you can, it's got a river going through the middle. Hmm. But you don't have to set it up this way. You can make it uh, right. however you want it. You can make it as big as you want. Yeah, Just as long as you it. want. Yeah. You know what? I would even do something like this. Don't laugh too hard. But as a runner carpet. Oh, yeah, that'd be awesome. Wouldn't that be cute? Yeah. I, mm, yeah, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. put some of the um, no slip stuff on the back. Yep, that would be amazing. Because you can just wash it. So, yeah. Oh, see, there we go. <laughs> I love that they do this. Oh, that's cool. I like the through the through the woods, and they've got a bunch of bushes all over. That's pretty cool. Different sizes. Oh, there's a little beach on this one. Oh, but you can see all the different blocks, right? Mm -hmm. So this is kind of like in a circle, and this is a lot more compliment. A whole bedroom carpet. Yeah, I know. I just think it would be oh, really cute. Totally, that would be awesome. Yeah. Full-size bedroom rug. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. Be, you know, you could also do it as a blanket. I don't know why I keep yeah. seeing it as a rug, but... Yeah, yeah. There's no reason it couldn't be a blanket. Wouldn't that be a heck of a quilt? Yeah. Whew. All right, now we're going to see the blocks. Except for when you send him to, to his room because he was bad, he'd sit there with the, on his bed with the, with the train and play. That's fine. <laughs> I would, too. That's awesome. I know. Oh, look at the little pond. Oh, and they're having a picnic. Oh, the details rocks and bushes and curves look at them I love all how the tracks done that is awesome nancy sorry i'm late glad you could join us you got a person sitting on the bridge yeah there was people picnicking hmm. oh and there's more here too on the de the deer in the top left oh man more here that's awesome the detail. <laughs> Cows. I just Jeez. think they, they look like arrows at first, <laughs> and then I realized what I was looking. It's exactly what an aerial view would look like. It's yeah. amazing. Look, you could do a whole bunch of farmland, and then you could have, like, farmer toys playing. Mm -hmm. Not necessary. Oh, the beach. Oh, yeah. Okay. I love the umbrella. The beach umbrellas. Yeah, they're cool. Heck love it. Yep. Love it. And more people sitting on benches along the river. Love it. Welcome. Very nice fabric choices, too. They really set it off. It's, um, I think these are called blenders, and mm -hmm. is they're beautiful, nice and bright, and it makes the river look amazing. And the grass, too. Kind of a pixelated version of it. Oh, wow. Rails and roads. The perfect play mat for all. Oh, are they combining? Uh, oh, mix, mix and, and mash up. up. Yep, oh, are. that's awesome. So then you can make crossing. Bonus block included. That's awesome. I'm so glad they did that. It's an extra block to make over the roads. Yep. Yeah, wow, you could make this huge. So, again, these are the, the race track, the train track, and then this is, what was it? Uh, the recreation station. Recreation station. Oh, countryside circuit. Oh, is that not awesome? <laughs> Have the racetrack on the side. So the cool. racetrack on the side roads and then the train track yeah. around it oh that's cool that is really cool and then there's special block to put it all together oh this is a tunnel cool cool 
Oh, I like that one too. And then the buildings and the water. Yeah, man, these are gorgeous. So the red ones are the special blocks that have the road and it looks great. That is so cool. I wish I had that when I was a kid. I know, I know. So that is totally impressive and that you can <laughs> mix and match together. I could probably sit and plan it out and have tons of fun. Too much fun, probably. All right. So Moody Plant Pals. Uh, I love this. I love this. So he's a happy pig and he's scared because there's a worm. And there's apple. Or the, or the bear that has honey and bees are stinging him. Oh, man. <laughs> that is it's cute. too cute. And the kitty playing with the wool. I kind of like the look on this pig's face. I love it. Yeah, he looks a little concerned. Yeah, but I like the eyes. And then, oh, that's cool. So the flip side, they have him smiling. I said that, yeah. No, I missed that. Sorry. One side, then yeah. the other. That's cool. Oh, they are <laughs> cute. Well, yeah, I would like this. I wouldn't put plants in it. However, I think this would be great at a sewing desk or at your desk oh, yeah. to hold your stuff. And then, you know, it could be like a warning. So if I turn it so the kitty, <laughs> the piggy's all mad and shocked, leave me alone. Something like that, maybe. Yeah, maybe. So applique. So it's one of these that because it has extras, you do the ears first in one hooping and cut them out set them aside and then you're going to add them to one side or the other I guess just one side right really cute designs I know these are adorable um batting <coughs> yeah pretty pretty basic back of the hoop because it's all lined right there we go wow I love this blender fabric with the darker brown that looks yeah. great <laughs> all the details <laughs> he looks so stressed and then at the back of the hoop this is just to cover everything up so when you sew them together i mean mr bear is even cute right here oh yeah it's cute so creating your base so like the bottom of it and it's just more applique and just a circle. So one so yeah, ears on each side. So once you get that done, sew them together. Again, this is so helpful. Oh, it's a little bit bigger than I thought, the one she's doing. Yeah. So cute. So sew them together. And oh yeah, if you didn't know how to sew a circle onto a square, this is how you do it. I guess you'd want it a little larger for some plants if you're putting them, putting plants in it. I, I love these instructions. I seriously do, because that is so helpful right oh, there yeah. to, to do it. Oh, so yeah. helpful. Okay, so Bear, I really like. I think he's cute. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> panda, Sleepy Panda. That kind of is you, really. Sleepy and hungry? Yeah, yeah. or Beatrice. Yeah, maybe. Okay, the pig looks like... <laughs> I know what swear word he's saying. <laughs> awesome. Kitty cat? Ooh, kitty cat's cute. <laughs> raccoon. <laughs> raccoon. <laughs> oh, my God. He's happy because he has an ice cream, and then he's crying because he dropped the ice cream. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That is absolutely adorable um i love it oh and a dog excited and angry he does Stay look a little yeah he does look a bit angry mm. those are awesome they would look great on the med cart to hold the vital sign equipment and let everyone know what kind of mood they are in yeah anything like that 
sneak peek of Wonder Wood quilt tile scene. Look at the blue cool. jay. I like how they tie it together. Wow, this is a sneak peek. Yeah, I just like how it's tied together with the tree. And that is beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, I can't wait to cool. see that. Sweet sayings. Uh, these are beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Like this color. I, I'm glad they're doing this for, for a lot of them because it's kind of neat to be able to combine them. Yeah. I, I'm especially thrilled with the train tracks. They, they help give you other ideas. Help inspire you. It, it does, actually. Like this is fantastic put together instead of having just you know all the same mm -hmm. chris yost is here yay hello chris glad you could join us so big 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 hoop uh nine and a half by 14 8 by 12 7 by 11 6 by 10 which i still don't have uh and <laughs> down to five by seven so which is really cute Again, lots of details on it. So, batting, add your background. A little more applique. Actually, that butterfly is gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's the color. So, just a little bit of applique for the butterfly, and the rest is stitching. Oh, yeah, these are beautiful. Oh, they are. So much detail. Crazy plant lady. <laughs> it's awesome, I guess. Life is good, yes. Grow a garden. Beautiful. Enjoy the journey. Oh, I like that with the two birds. Yeah, that's nice. Stay curious. Mm -hmm. Make today better. That's the butterfly one. Okay. I really like that one. Enjoy every moment. This too shall pass. Look at the happy bunnies. They have expression. I they love do. it. A couple of them would make a great placemat. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. And combine it with something else. Um, even folded fabric blocks with the same colors. Uh, that would be awesome. Focus on the... What the heck? What's the matter? Oh, Tank's still under my desk. Oh. He just bonked me. Sorry. <laughs> Not used to a big dog curled up in an itty-bitty. Anyways, yeah, he just got up and groaned. He bonked my knee. It scared in me. Mm. Shine kindness. See, I like the other awesome. butterfly better yep. for some reason. <laughs> However, it is cute. Oh, and then the sashing. Okay. Nice. Paint with all Ooh, the colors. Awesome. Okay, these are bold. Those Sarah are. says, hi, Tank. Yeah, I don't know why he's under my desk <laughs> in the dash hound bed. He's a big <laughs> dog. But anyways, uh, are these all applique? Because that's going to be fun. That's beautiful. Nice and bright. I love it. Oh, some are applique, some aren't. Look at them together, though. Wow. Yeah. Oh, I That'd like awesome. that one. I know. It's almost like a Zen doodle sort of thing. Yeah. I love it. All right. So, batting, background, bright colors. Oh, love it. Little bit of applique going on, and then stitching. Awesome. Wow. I'm just looking at the final going, awesome. Yep. That's real. Oh, now we can see them close up. Wow. I'm, yeah, I like the single flowers too. Judy Quilt says one size four inch square is interesting. Yeah. Oh. That is interesting, actually. So, all this detail in small, that's awesome. I absolutely love these. For sure. For sure. Well, that makes it for everyone. I, I'm going to show Lynn those. these. So, nice for bright. sure. Yeah, I nice love them. Bright. The style is fantastic. Yeah. 
and the black satin stitches around everything mm -hmm. gives it a, a certain look. So steps. So I think we need to do one of these houses for so long. So we'll pick that. Um, we wanted to see. I mean, I want to watch oh, one of those stitches. I know, I know. It would actually be worth it. <clears throat> so. 71,000 stitches, which is not a lot for what it is. So the black work quick stitch. This is what I wanted to look at. So, oh, it's not too bad. Oh, not at all. Uh, not at all. I'm really surprised. What's so the, the big, 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 big hoop is 40,000 for this one and 61,000. The most is 86,000. Yeah. And the more detailed ones. Yeah, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. For, for that size? No, it's not. That That's something to think about. I can get that many stitches in a 5x7, so yeah. So, that's yeah. Good. <laughs> that's all we wanted to see was that. So, uh, the no, train thing... Train. I'm going to find some kind of excuse to stitch it. Stitch something, yeah. yeah, for sure. Oh, and yeah. yeah. Sam might like a couple of those plant pals because she has some plants in her apartment. She, she would think that's funny, I think. Mm -hmm. Grouchy. Or we'd have to get her the sleepy one, though, because she's <laughs> working nights all sleepy the time. And hungry. So these are the instructions for all the files. So, okay, one, one size. size, four by four. You know, it would be really cute to put a whole bunch of them together. Yeah. Uh, Judy Quilt says, seasonal house trios for so long. Yeah, I know. You could even make train track coaster and placements. Now yeah. you're thinking, Sarah. That's cool. A place, wouldn't that be cute? A little placemat. And, and actually what you could do is take the placemats uh, that go together mm -hmm. um, or make them go together and you move them into the center and it would be a train thing. That'd Circle cool. around yep. it yep. and then separate them if that made any sense. Okay, so this is what we always do. Pick our favorites. Well, for me, it is Midsummer Night Tapestry and Seasonal House Trios. I really find that that's beautiful. Mm -hmm. I like the tapestry and yeah. the charming cottages. They're beautiful. And although I love everything have to go with the black work first. Really? That's an interesting choice. Sarah says tapestry. I just like that style. I like the, the detail that you can get into them. Beautiful. And actually it would be beautiful to watch it stitch mm -hmm. out. So time release video for one of these charming cottages because I would love to see it stitch out. Stitch along for this. Um... And I think I would do a sewing verse for this. I love the lumbar pillow as it's quicker. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. You know what? Yeah, for sure. Seasonal house trio, um, moody plant pals, train track play mat. I know the train track is so fantastic. It is a great issue for sure. I'm really happy with it. They are so good all the time. It's just thrilling. So I'll go ahead and pencil these in. So let me know after. Um, you could do a tassel making demo too. Could do. Yeah, why not? Yeah, for the pillow. That's a good idea, actually. Um, let me know what your favorite is. And I will put these on the schedule because that's awesome. This one will just be available when it's available, and a sewing verse will work together to sew all these blocks because they're just stitching, so it's not really too much to watch. Yeah. So, thanks everyone for watching. I hope you guys like this video. Please like this video. I really love um, all of these designs, actually. In between Don and I, we love them all. 
I want an excuse to make a train track. <laughs> I'll think of one and I'll make it. So, yeah, share with your friends. This is a fantastic, fantastic month. I love That's it. That's amazing. So, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Bye, everyone. Oh, that was awesome. I just love it.